being here in Washington, D.C. for the Boy Scout Jamboree gives us this chance to visit the Smithsonian Institution. Gosh, T-Bob, the Wright Brothers' airplane, even George Washington's false teeth. Just think of all the old things they keep here. Yeah, sort of like the stuff in the refrigerator in your room. What's that thing, Hondo? It's called a Foucault pendulum. It proved that the Earth spins on its axis. This is fun. What's next, Hondo? That's up to Tommy Thompson, our assistant scoutmaster. Tommy. We're going to see a completely furnished home from the Civil War period. Imagine living in a home like this. It doesn't even have electricity. No electricity? No thanks. I don't think I get much of a charge out of that. <laughs> But I don't want a merit badge for courage. Scott, no. Tommy, call security. <gasps> oh. Powerhouse, on! Please stay calm, Scott. Tommy notified security. They'll handle this for now. Hondo, what's up, big guy? The two musketeers pulling stunts again? Nothing that simple, I'm afraid. Something strange has come up, and Venom's involved. Well, there's nothing strange about Venom being involved in something strange. One of Mayhem's bimbos heisted an old quilt from the Smithsonian just a few minutes ago. That's it? Yep. The museum people say it's practically worthless. It's a puzzle, all right. Will you come? Select the mask agents best suited to this mission. Personnel selection complete. Bruce Sato, mechanical engineer and design specialist. Vehicle code name Rhino. Knowledge of design principles could be critical to this mission. Leffler, martial arts master and natural disaster specialist, vehicle code name Volcano Band. Added firepower capabilities could prove necessary. Hondo McLean pre selected, vehicle code name Hurricane. Personnel approved. Assemble Mobile Armored Strike Command. What's our mission, Matt? Must be pretty important, eh? Hondo reports that Venom's just stolen a quilt. But it's probably just a cover for something else. Gosh, a quilt? Oh, that could be so dangerous. Square knot is very desirable because it won't slip. Then it's just what T-Bob needs to keep his scout cap on. <laughs> now I want everybody to try it. Remember, 
You'll be able to earn merit badges when you can make several knots properly. T-Bob, I'm going to make it and earn myself a merit badge. Uh-oh. Looks like we're a couple of ropes short. That's okay, Hondo. I can practice on T-Bob's arms and legs. They're flexible enough. See? Don't help me, T-Bob. I know how to tie it. Oh, I'm not worried about that. I just hope you know how to untie it. Just hold still. There. Oh, I guess I should be glad my neck doesn't extend farther, too. Hmm, it doesn't seem right. Scott. Well, uh, you know, Scott, I bet you'd be better at, say, uh, first aid. There, I did it. Much better, Scott. In fact, you might get a merit badge. Oh, I'd like to get something, too. I'd like to get out of here. Well, T-Bob, if there's a merit badge for being a good sport, you're sure to win it. <laughs> a good sport? I don't know if I can be a good sport, but my uncle was a good sports car. <laughs> <laughs> okay, everybody, gather round and listen up. Now we're going to test your sewing ability. Sewing? That's for sissies, isn't it? No, young man, it is not. And besides, You'll be sorry if you miss out on this opportunity. I'm going to pass around this piece of cloth, and I want each and every one of you to sew your initials on it. Yes, yes sir. sir. I hope you guys will excuse my outfit. I sure wish I could wear short pants. Any more news on the stolen quilt or anything else on Venom? No, it's all still a mystery. Come on, I'll show you where it happened. The screen by the fireplace. Get it. If you had sent me here yesterday instead of that idiot Gory, we wouldn't have had to come back. Shut up. Let's go. <laughs> Get out of our way! Piper, on! Crap! It isn't working fast enough! Come on, Rax! We'll have to get out the front way! <gasps> I dare you all to get in my way! There! Piper, on! Scott, T-Bob, the railing! Grab the second level railing! T-Bob, there it is! Grab onto it! Oh, Scott! Hold on to me! <sighs> Boy, Dad, thanks. You're doing fine, son. Uh, I guess we almost found out what bowling pins feel like. Lucky for us, we had a spare moment. <laughs> That's right, T-Bob. You did good. Dad, T-Bob and I want to go with you and Hondo. Oh, why would I want to go anywhere? It's dangerous enough right here. Looks like they got away, Matt. We'd better see if we can pick up the trail while it's still fresh. I've never known Venom to make a clean getaway. For one thing, all their vehicles use a special high-octane fuel. We can use Hurricane's infrared scanners to locate the fuel's trace elements and track them back to their hideout. Bingo! Time to track those turkeys. Let's get going.
Access Smithsonian Interface. Connect. Connection established. Proceed. Selection subroutine. Exhibits. Selected. Show the Civil War quilt, please. Patchwork quilt. American Civil War period. Handmade. Very common. Many have survived to this day. This example is not particularly good, but was chosen as typical of the period. It does not seem likely that anything could have been hidden in it. It hardly even looks like it would be very warm on a cold night. Its only value is historical, and it's hardly that. You don't suppose it could be just a trick? Yeah, a mystery that Venom dreamed up to keep us busy while they pull off a real caper somewhere else. Let's try the fireplace screen. New search parameters. Fireplace screen, American Civil War period. Low-grade iron, very common. Many have survived to this day. This example is not particularly good, but was chosen as typical of the period. Could there be something about the pattern made by the holes? Good idea. Holes, any pattern, analysis. Analysis complete. No meaningful pattern determined. So far, everything's going according to plan. Gosh, we're so lucky to be working for someone as smart as you. Hey, Gory, are your brains leaking out of your mouth? Or is that just your tongue? Sticks and stones will break my bones. Ha, <laughs> you don't have any bones, you little jellyfish. Uh, mayhem. Speaking of bones, let's not make any bones about it. When do I get my share? Relax, Malloy. None of us have anything yet, and you know it. Now let's move it. Okay, all you scouts, gather around. Good job, Truth. Everybody's initials are on this now. Yeah, but what's it for? You'll see. Hey, yo! Truth 49, ready over there? We are ready. Gosh. What on earth are they making? I don't know. Maybe it's a new quilt for the Smithsonian. Golly, T-Bob, it's going to be much too big for that. If my scanner says that Venom's trail leads here, then this is where it leads. No doubt about it. We found it! Sacre bleu! The fireplace screen is here too, but no sign of Van Am. There doesn't seem to be any damage. Matt, look here! What do you think of this? Hmm, the stitching between the patchwork pieces. It does seem to form some sort of pattern, but nothing I can recognize. That's it. A little higher on the left, Jacques. Oui, mon ami. How's this? Nope. No good. Two sides to a coin means two ways to join. Hey, Bruce. You stay up at night to come up with that stuff or what? Bruce is right. There is another way to look at this. You two guys trade places. Turn it around 180 degrees. I hope this is it. This thing is heavy. The way I figure it, there are at least eight different ways of looking at it. And this is only way number two. That's what I like about you, Lumberjack. You always think of something encouraging to say. <laughs> it's a message in Morse code. It says there's three million dollars buried right near the Washington Monument. The Washington Monument? 
Matt, that's right near where all the scouts are. Come on, hurry up! The fireworks will provide a perfect cover! Right, boss. Anything you say. Right, boss. Right, boss. You're disgusting, Gory, you know that. Just get that string bean you call a body moving. You better be sure that this is the precise spot, or else... You think I'm an idiot like those other two? Of course not. You're much more a unique idiot. So just answer the question. I told you it was... We're all set. Sir, sir, I think I'm going to be sick or something. wanted to flag down Venom. It's wet, Bob. We've got to do something. Scott, no! We have to stay here. Listen, I'm about at the end of my rope with you. T-Bob! That's it! <laughs> Nothing can stop me now, huh? Ah! Ah! Oh, oh, right, right! Yeah, we, we did, did it! it. Oh, right. We did it! <laughs> <laughs> Everything turned out well. The museum got back the quilt and the fireplace screen in good condition. Yes, plus a whole chest of Confederate money. I thought all that money wasn't worth anything. Well, Scott, nobody can spend it, but the museum has more than enough to sell some of it as souvenirs. And they can use the money to pay for fixing the Foucault Pendulum. Boy, this trip to Washington, D.C. sure has been exciting. I'm kind of sorry that it's over. Yeah, now it's all history. <laughs> <laughs> In a little while, it's going to be my new model boat. I just have to carve it with my scout pen knife. You'll be sure to use it the way I taught you. Always keep your legs and other parts of your body away from the blade. And always stroke the knife in a direction away from your body. Never pull the knife toward you. Right, Dad because it might slip and you could cut yourself. Safety is everybody's business. 